Hey guys, um, so here's the castle. He's in slow mode because I want to make sure that first layer sticks real good. And uh, he's doing a beautiful job. I've got the new wiring uh, stabilizer on top there. All the wires have been redone. I know it looks horrible, but it really is the best I can do. And then if I can get in there, that is the uh, Micro Swiss 0 0.5, 0 0.5. And that is a V6 block. You can see how you can't see, but it's really wide, so it causes some troubles. I'm printing my feet. I'm almost done with all my upgrades. And then over here, this bad boy. This is the Ender 3 cranking away and um, also making feet. This is at full speed for the Ender, which is slow. You can see it's had warping issues already. I don't know why. Um, I'm using glue stick on both beds. It's, um, it just helps. At this point I'd rather have hard to get off prints than, um, prints that, uh, fly off after three hours. Ah, <laughs> uh, here's my toolbox. And these are, I have to use this flashlight because otherwise it'd be too dark. Here's some of my prints that I've gotten. I've got my, uh, temperature tower, which came out perfect. Um, for all temperatures, although 210 really came out good. I've got a longer uh, fan shroud in purple because the nozzle's higher now than before. I've got a cable guide that's not quite the right angle. I need a different one. The blue blue um, are prints from the Cossel and purple are prints from the Ender. And this is cheap PLA. And there's my beautiful fish came out pretty good, so purple, so that is from the Ender 3. And now, we have our, I just, the lines completely meld into each other in just one beautiful continuous gl glob. There's no lines, it's just a complete stream. It's gorgeous. So now that it's got some, let's show you what this bad boy can really do. Let's crank her up a bit, hold on. Just a second. Now, that's Adam. Just 60, it's not that fast. Um, I'm still learning just how fast this thing can go, but it can definitely crank or twice this. So, still having some calibration issues with the height, but it's getting better slowly. And uh, well, that's the Ultra Base. I don't even have special clips, it just sticks on so good. And those are just PLA, and they, they, they seem just fine, so. There you go. Go do, do your stuff. I did a test earlier with it at 200 and knocked my part across the room, so I won't do that again. I think it's doing real good. I can get lower. Yeah, there's no strings at all, it's just a good layer. I like that. It only took uh, probably 30 days working three or four hours a day on it. <laughs> but the result is worth it. And that's my console progress for the day.